All right, all right, guys. Welcome to Rant and Chill, channel where I like to rant and I like to chill. It's a very simple concept, right? All right, here we're going to be chilling. We're going to be reacting to When I'm Alone, We All Cried. That's the title of the video. Let's see if everyone cries here. This is my first time checking out this performance. And yes, it's a fan cam for those. There's always that one. Be like, you always grab these fan cams. That's all there is for this particular video. So that's why we are using it. And yes, the audio is going to be what it is. If you don't like it, I'm telling you what it is. All right. Anyway. Anyway, I like these sort of things. I do them at times. Right. I want to make sure the audio is kind of good, you know, to work with. I understand. Uh, because I, I like to kind of see what it was like there. You know, sometimes it's sometimes you're able to get the feeling of what it was like there a little bit. Sometimes that uh, is carried over, but sometimes not. OK. Anyway, with that said, let's go to get into this when I'm alone by the warning live at Adatoro Monterey. OK. All right. Uh, it was October. OK. 2023. Yeah, cat is looking at the hand, giving me the warning. Because of the warning, that's why. All right, let's put it on the screen here and press that play button. <laughs> I am the danger cat. I'm the danger. Let's enhance this. Yeah. 
gracias. Aquí estamos con ustedes y nuestra música aquí está para ustedes. ¡Te vamos! ¡Eres la mejor! Nobody a very powerful performance there i it was just so intimate it was like she was i don't know how big this um you know this this venue is you know i don't know the size of the crowd or anything but i would imagine it's a pretty good size and uh you know she had a the way she presented herself just playing the guitar right there uh sitting down um and the way she just poured her heart out on this song and it was you know, she had an emotional experience there. You know, she was crying and stuff. And, um, it, you know, she was very vulnerable with that crowd, you can't think. Uh, and I, I recognize that from over here. I'm, it, you know, they they most definitely recognized it when they were there, right? Um, and to have that experience with, with Danny, uh, that's something that's something you remember. That's like the, the highlight of the show, if you will. That's, that's um, a powerful moment. Uh, it's cool, man. It's... Yeah, when I'm alone, this is not the first time I've reacted to, to this song. You know, not the first time I heard this song. Uh, lyrically, it's uh, it's it's a pretty heavy song. Uh, if you if you really just pause and allow the the words to kind of seep into your skin, really get in and where you feel it, right? Uh, it can be kind of chilling. It's a, it's, you know, my experience with the song, it's kind of, um, like it, I don't know about for you, but for me, it's like it, it, it takes me to that moment where, uh, I had to see the things I've done and, and really just, um, I guess re-experience things that, uh, like maybe regrets or, you know, times, uh, that are kind of more, uh, I guess impactful emotionally one way or the other and it's just like you just kind of feel it it's a it's a pretty good song in that way uh so yeah that was when i'm alone we all cried and they did uh the warning live so if this doesn't get you hyped up to see the warning live i don't know what will uh you'll have a real experience probably most likely i mean you're gonna have a real experience either way these girls are great they're fine but like you know when they come when they when they rock and kick ass they rock and kick ass okay when they play like ballads and emotional emotionally heavy songs you're gonna feel it right so if this doesn't get you hyped up to see the band i don't know what will and that's the value of a fan cam okay anyway with that said you guys let me know what you thought about it and y'all take it easy <laughs>